My name is Candy Spangler with Jetta Viva. Join me today in beautiful Colorado as we explore the Citation XL, XLS, and XLS Plus. So today we're going to look at the XLS Plus, but as we walk around the airplane, I'll be sure to point out the differences between this airplane and the XLS and the XL. So the great thing about the Citation XL series is that Cessna went to the parts bin and put together great features that already existed. They took the fuselage of the Citation 10 with its big roofing cabin and mated it to the wing of the Citation 5 Ultra, allowing it to take off and land from short runways. This airplane is equipped with the Pratt & Whitney 545C engines, which have 4,100 pounds of thrust, allowing you to take off and climb to flight level 450 in 29 minutes. Coupled with this wing, it's an optimal performer. So clearly the top performer is the XLS Plus. The only notable difference in the XL series is on the Citation XL with 545A engines, which is rated to 3,800 pounds of takeoff thrust. And while it's still certified to a flight level of 450, it requires a step climb to get there. Speaking of performance, Cessna equipped all three aircraft with trailing link gear, allowing for much smoother landings. Forward of the battery access panel is a door for the braking system hydraulics. This can be found on the XLS and XLS Plus, but not on the XL. Looking at the XL platform across the board with five passengers and a cruise speed of 420 knots, the XL has a range of approximately 1,600 nautical miles, while the XLS and XLS Plus boost that number to a range of 1,750 nautical miles. All of this allows you and your passengers to reach your destination in a timely manner. So here we are inside the XLS Plus. As you can see, it's a beautifully appointed, very spacious interior. It measures 67 inches wide by 68 inches tall. A typical configuration for the XL series is this four place center club and then two forward facing aft seats. The center club seating has two tables that fold out. Another really nice feature in the XLS Plus and the XLS is the LED lighting. And to help you be productive in the air, we've got 110 outlets in this airplane and optional Wi-Fi. This particular XLS Plus is equipped with a two-place side-facing divan across from the main entry door. Another option is to get a single-place seat here and have extended storage and refreshment center space. This particular XLS Plus has a Rosen moving map option. Other options include Wi-Fi, internet, and onboard communication systems so you can stay in touch with your home office. A lot of these systems can be controlled through your iPad or your iOS device. The lavatory is equipped with a hard door that seals at both the top and the bottom and contains a storage closet for jackets and other small items. As you can see, this XLS Plus has a belted seat across from the lav. Other configurations replace this belted seat with a full sink or extra storage. The XLS Plus comes equipped with the Advanced ProLine 21 Avionics Suite, while the XL and XLS are equipped with Primus 1000 Avionics. The XLS and XLS Plus are approved for CAT 2 operations, allowing pilots to descend to lower approach minimums and are equipped with an emergency descent mode as well as TCAS 2 and TAWS. XM weather and GPS navigation are also standard on the XLS Plus. With the opportunity to upgrade the XL with the Garmin 5000 avionics suite, the XL platform will be a viable solution for many years to come. Thanks for joining us today as we explored the XL, XLS, and XLS Plus. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact us because we like talking about them almost as much as we love flying them.